the best, if not possibly the most valuable card in the entire set. Oh my god, dude, stop the show! This is not what? Oh, what are these packs now? Something fishy's going on right now. This is not real life right now. This is an entire factory case of 10 elite trainer boxes of the brand new Scarlet and Violet 151 set. The boxes are beautifully designed and feature one of the original 151 Pokemon, Snorlax. Inside each ETB features nine booster packs, exclusive sleeves and dividers, as well as an exclusive promo card. We're gonna be cracking into every single one of these ETBs today, but I also wanted to let you know that I'm gonna be giving away one sealed box to one subscriber here on the channel. So if you'd like to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is number one, smash the like button. Number two, make sure you subscribe to the channel with notifications on. And then number three, leave a comment down below in the comment section. All right, so here we have it. This is the Scarlet Violet 151 Elite Trainer Box. And the uh, design of this box is actually amazing. Like, I love the white background with the Snorlax there and then all the other Pokemon around it. It looks really cool, and um, there's a ton of different things inside of here. But all right, let's slice into this box and let's check this thing out and see exactly what we get inside of our ETB. This is cool. Okay, I, I can't wait to see. Actually, I haven't even seen the set list yet. I know, I've, like, obviously the Japanese version. I don't know if it's... I mean, it is a little bit different, so we'll see, like... Oh, wait, actually. Dude, this is different. This is not, like, a glossy finish. This is just, like, straight up just regular like paper feeling. I don't know. I just noticed that right away. And of course you can always open these up and there's usually a design inside. So let's see. Um, oh, okay. It's just going to be your regular, I don't know if you guys can see that. It's just the uh, regular sort of like, uh, you know, lineup of the original Pokemon. All right. But this is interesting though. Let's check this out. All right. So player's guide. Welcome to Pokemon TC Scarlet Violet 151 expansion. We got Venusaur, Charizard, and Blastoise full art cards. Of course, there's also those special illustration rare versions of them. We got the Mew EX in there as well. Some more information on fossil Pokemon, evolutionary lines, abilities. And I just want to really just get to the set list here and actually see if this set list is pretty much identical to the Japanese version um, or if it's a little different. All right, so we got our EXs there, the Charizard, Venusaur, Blastoise, then all of our uncommon. It's a really weird feeling how this paper is uh, completely different. The regular EXs, we're going to keep going through here until we get to like the bigger stuff, uh, which is usually towards the end here. And we should be there right after this one. Yeah, okay, so here we go. So we have our illustration rares. That all looks about the same. You got that Charmeleon. Evolution line there, uh, Bulbasaur, Squirtle. You got the full arts. You got the rest of the illustration rares. We got more of the full arts there. Looks pretty good. The Snorlax um, is going to be inside of the here actually, and uh, so we have more full arts as well. And then we do have our special illustration rares there, and then the same gold cards. I think this is pretty identical. Um, yeah, and then the Snorlax, the Mewtwo and Mew as well. So you know what? It looks like these are going to be promo cards. I think. Uh, found in the Pokemon TCG Scarlet Violet 151. Yeah, Ultra Premium Collection Box is going to have these. Oh, these are... Okay, that's kind of weird. I mean, these are probably some of my favorite from the special illustration. Uh, I guess that's okay because you will be able to get them in the Ultra Premium Box. But it would be kind of cool just to be able to pull them in the normal set because they are kind of big hitter cards, honestly. So overall, what I think is those three cards, the one illustration rare of the Snorlax, the two special illustrations of the Mewtwo and the Mew um, that aren't in here, but there's also not gonna be those Master Balls uh, special reverses that we saw in the Japanese version in here. Um, but we do have the energies in the back that are different, the full uh, hollow energies that you guys saw maybe in the last video that we did. But anyway, let's just get into it. So those are the differences. Let's, uh, oh, this is cool. Okay, so now we have this sort of background of the Pokemon, but in more of like a gray silver style on there no uh sort of like color to it all right let's see what we got here let's see the setup so we do have the standard stuff in the middle here you got your dice um and then you have your status counters as well it's kind of like the new setup that they have for scarlet and violet and then we do have our packs over there but i want to see what we have on this other side uh in terms of uh you know the other goodies and stuff well we have energies and uh, I kind of just have to go through it because, like, I can't. I got to at least make 100% sure that these ETBs are just energies in here. And they are. Okay. Now, I'll never do that again for these ETBs. I just need to know for sure. Um, okay. So, we have our dividers, I think, if I could get them. Yeah, there we go. Ooh, okay. These look, dude, I love this with the Gen 1 stuff, the different colors and everything like that. So, we have uh, our four dividers here. And then they should have, is it different ones on the back, too? Yeah, different ones on the back. So... All different Pokemon here. Uh, maybe the same. I don't know. But yeah, uh, we got all different Pokemon on these. It's cool. It's like a basic style, but it works. It looks good. I, I mean, I like it a lot. And uh, then we're going to keep going through here see what else we got. 
So we should have the sleeves. Okay. These are cool because these are even nicer because they're kind of like, oh, they're not glossy. Okay. There's no gloss on that. And that sort of has like that foggy. Yeah. Okay. That's definitely the foggy style. But yeah, these are the sleeves. So let me know what you guys think of these down below in the comment section. And then we want to keep going through here. We'll get to that promo card in a second. Uh, oh my gosh. If I can get in here, there should be something else, right? Yeah. Okay. There is. There's a code card. There's the ETB code card you guys can grab. And then that's what everybody wants to see, right? It's, oh, okay. Well, the background's gonna be half down. <laughs> all right, that's better. Um, so here's our promo card. Let's uh, get this out of here so we can see it in all its glory. This is definitely one of my favorite illustration rares, um, and I'm glad that they featured it. The back looks pretty much perfect. Let's check out the card. Oh, man, there we go. The Snorlax illustration in English now. We have seen these in Japanese and we open them on the channel, but super cool to see this as a promo card. Definitely one of the best ones in my opinion. All right, last but not least. The other cool part about this is going to be all of our booster packs. So there should be nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's solid. Okay. Nine of these packs because the MSR pre P did increase, if I could talk, on uh, Scarlet and Violet stuff. So you get nine packs in there and you get a promo card in every single ETB made, not just the special ones. All right, but let's go through these. We're going to open up all the other packs as well. See if we get some banger pulls. I'm excited for this. Uh, we had a little taste of it yesterday. If you guys missed that video, make sure to check it out. I'm interested to see if the pull rate is different on these compared to the main series Scarlet and Violet sets. I have a hunch. I could be 100% wrong, but I have a hunch that these pull rates might be a little bit not as good. And I'm not really counting these hollows in the back, um, but they're sick. They are, they are beautiful. I love that they added these in here. I'm not really fully counting those as pulls, though. All right. But, yeah, so I haven't really had anything yet. Let's see what this ETB has for us here. But let me know. I, mean, I Again, I don't know because I barely – I've only opened 60 packs of this set. So that's definitely nowhere near enough to be able to know how the pull rates are going to be on here. I hope that they're amazing. I hope that we get, like, so much cool stuff. But it kind of felt like – Got a wiggly tough EX. Kind of felt a little bit less crazy, but I don't know. We'll just have to see. Because the only way we could know is just keep opening packs up. So that's what we're going to do. Just keep opening those packs up, baby. All right. Not too good right now. Hopefully it gets better on these final three packs. Come on. Slowpoke, Magmar, Butterfree, Lapras. We got Staryu, Dratini, and a Mewtwo Hollow. Okay, now I'm doing really bad all of a sudden. Why does this always happen? Come on. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going down like this. We're going to get some nice stuff. Polyrath, Pidgeot, Coughing. Oh my god, this is actually terrible. Wow, this is really bad. This is like... I got one EX. Wow, okay. Is there going to be anything in here? I don't, I don't think there is. Oh, just the regular Energy Hollow. Wow. And I'm not going to make you watch me open all those Elite Trainer boxes. Because I already got them done for you now. Except for that first one. So let's just go through these. Um, this isn't all of the packs, but this is like half of them. So, um, Wow, okay. That's great. <laughs> I don't know what's going on here. I don't know what happened. Come on. As soon as I say bad luck, it just gives us bad luck. Oh my, this is really not good. We got an energy. Come on, ETBs, pull through. I mean, yesterday was it was good. Like we got good pulls. It wasn't this bad. Like this is really bad right now. Nine tails EX. I think that's the first time we're seeing the nine tails pull. I will take that. Yeah, just regular EXs so far. Let me know if you guys are planning on opening up Scarlet and Violet 151. This is the second uh, video in the series. We're going to be opening up all the brand new products here. Uh, yesterday, we did a booster box, which technically there aren't booster boxes in the set, but we had our own booster box of this set. Oh, my God. What is that? Dude, what the heck is going on? What is happening right now? That's so bad. There's got to be. There's got to be something, baby. Oh my god! What? <laughs> Dude, no way! Oh my god! This is the crazy back ever! Dude! Oh my god, if only that was a hollow fire! But it was we just pulled this special illustration Charizard EX! The regular Charizard EX as well! What the heck is this bag? No way! Oh my god! Two Charizards in one pack? Scarlet by one through one, dude, kinda hits. That was worth the wait. One of the best, if not possibly the most valuable card in the entire set. There's no prices yet because this set is, doesn't release till the 22nd. But uh, we could use our imagination and we just pulled the best card, I think. Dang, dude, let's go. And we got that regular EX as well. That was a great pack. Okay, we're back on track now. We had to we had to kind of start slow to take that uh, crazy pack in there. That's cool. All right, so I guess you could technically get three pulls. There we go. We got that water. Hollow Energy. I want to see a pack with three pulls in it. Let's see if we can do that. Come on. 
All right. We got nothing. Yeah, it's interesting here. Um, all right. I do, I do kind of wish that Mewtwo and Mew were able to be pulled. But, you know, it is what it is. You can at least get an Ultra Premium Collection box and get them. Um, yeah, we'll see how those are. The Ultra Premium Collection boxes have been a, a pretty pretty popular. The last couple that they did were pretty wild. The Charizard one, the Celebrations one was like the first one before that. Um, they're pretty cool. They're usually really cool, honestly. What do we got? We got something good. Come on. We got something good. I think it's a regular full art. Ooh, nine tails net. Wow. That yellow. That looks... Is that how the... Is that how the Japanese one looked? Is that how the Japanese one looked? Why do I feel like this is like a different color? I could be completely wrong, but I don't remember it being yellow like that. Maybe I guess it was like that. Maybe I just pulled one of those nine tails. I really don't remember it being all yellow like that. It looks actually amazing. Uh, really cool artwork. Let's see what else we got. Oh my god, dude, stop the show! This is nuts! What? Dude, what is happening? What? What? Oh my god, I'm back on my Charizard pulling spree, baby! You can't stop me now! What the heck, dude? That's not even normal! Dude, I'm back! Oh my god, I thought Obsidian Flames took all the Charizards, but... Nah, this is... Okay. You gotta be kidding me, man! That's nuts! Sorry, we can't forget you too, Venusaur! Oh my... Okay, that's too crazy. Oh, what are these packs now? Oh my god! I am like pulling the Charizard special illustration rare left and white right. I can't even talk anymore. What is happening, yo? These ETBs, kind of crazy. They're like all or nothing. They're like, oh my god, dude! What is this opening right now? What is this? <laughs> I can't stop, dude. Did we just pull every Charizard in the set? Wait, did we just pull every Charizard in the set? These ETBs are nuts. I can't believe it, but we somehow pulled every single Charizard in this set already. What? How? Literally, like, like it was nothing. And we pulled it. We pulled this twice. That is okay. I'm back on Charizard pulls again, baby. I cannot be stopped. I know Obsidian Flames was way easier on the pull rates, but now it's 151. I've proven myself to be able to pull all the Charizards again. I don't know how I'm doing it. Uh, that is like statistically insane because there's so many other cards you could pull. But right now, most of our pulls today have just been the Charizards. That's it. The only other cards we pulled were like two Ninetales and one other EX and a Venusaur. I think that's it. And the rest, like four cards were all Charizard. Bro. Okay. These ETBs are pretty insane, I got to say. They're pretty insane right now. Okay, okay. It's like weird because it'll go with like a bunch of packs with like absolutely nothing. And then we'll just start pulling like the craziest cards in the set. All right. That's what I'm talking about. I don't know what's going on until we open a lot of packs and we see a lot more of the, like, stuff that people pull and how much of it they pull. And oh, my mime. Okay. Oh, no. That might just be the end of our luck right there. Two mimes in a pack is unforgivable. 100% unforgivable. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Oof. All right. Come on. Let's see what else we get out of these ETBs. Interesting sort of pulls that we got here. Gengar. Gengar. And a lightning energy hollow. Very interesting. Okay, I like, I like the flow of this set. It's very interesting. It's very Gen One, obviously. Kangaskhan making an appearance. These EXs, I feel like, are pretty easy to pull. Like the EX pull rate, I feel like is like one in five. Uh, I actually haven't pulled that many today, but yesterday we were pulling them left and right. Wow, two special illustration Charizards, the full art, the regular EX. That's kind of fire, dude. <laughs> dude, seriously, what is happening right now? I genuinely don't know. There's so many other cards we could get, but we just keep getting all the Charizards. We pulled five Charizards so far today. Five Charizard out of what? How many packs? Oh, my God. What is this now? Dude, please. I just pulled the Mew, the gold Mew le yesterday's video. What are we going to get in today's? Oh, I'll take it again, dude. I don't care. I'll take it again. What is this opening right now? This is insane. I was going to say there's two other gold cards, but they're like trainer type cards. I'll take another Mew any day. That's so beautiful. And you know what? I don't need this second Mew gold card. I want to give it away to one person. So follow me on Instagram. You could scan that QR code in the back or just type in PokeRev on Instagram. Make sure it's my just PokeRev. No, yeah, just watch out for all the fake accounts. But it, make sure it's the official one. Um, and just give me a follow there. And uh, I will announce the winners one week from today so make sure you keep an eye out for that there'll be i don't know if i explained it correctly enough but there'll be a post on my instagram just go to my page and go to the post there and there'll be a picture of it and information on enter the giveaway um charmeleon right you all right let's keep it rolling here we go geodude 
Hitmon Lee, Dodrio, and we got our Energy Holly. We got two more packs. Well, we don't have two more packs. We have another stack of packs from the ETBs. But uh, two more on the table anyway. Let's see what else we can do. Oh, my Charizard. What is this today? A half a dozen. Bro, literally just got a half a dozen Charizards. Trying to think. Did I even pull any Charizard yesterday? Yesterday we opened 60 packs. I might have. I don't think I pulled any. I don't think we pulled any chart. Maybe one. But I don't think so. Zapdos EX. All right, next stack up, baby. We're not even, like, seeing any of the other starter Pokemon. It's just Charizard, 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 Charizard. Six Charizard. Nonstop. Unreal. I'm about to complete, like, multiple sets of the Charizards. Like, the three Charizard sets. Crazy. I'm not going to stop on all those Hollow Energies anymore, I don't think. There's just too many. I feel like I get them, like, one in every three or four packs. They are cool, but... Dude, that looks like an Alakazam hand. But no. It might be a legendary bird. No, I think it's Alakazam's hand. I think it's Alakazam. Oh, look, Sam. There we go. EX full art. Second time pulling that card. But I take them. All right. This is, yeah, this is cool. This is good. This is good. I like this. I like the flow of this set. I like the pulls. All right. Had more energy hollows there. Let's see what else we get from our ETBs today. Starmie. Yeah, this is fun, though. I'm, I'm really enjoying this. Uh, Opening this setup. This is cool. It's a different, it's a little bit of a different pace. It's obviously a throwback. Gen 1, baby. I'm curious uh, how popular this set will be because, you know, Evolutions dropped in 2016. That was like one of the most popular sets of all time, honestly. But it was because it, it was because it was basically a reprint. Not, re not really a reprint, but it was, I, pretty close or similar to original base set 1999 and uh, there's so many people that grew up with that so it definitely hit like a huge audience people and it got a lot of people back in it was right when Pokemon Go was released so it was like a pretty crazy effect that had on getting people back into Pokemon cards so I'm curious you know it's not base set but it is based off of artworks from base set if you guys didn't know that a lot of the different artworks are different sort of like versions of those so it's cool to see um but yeah i'm curious how popular this set will be the only thing that's kind of tough with this one is unlike evolutions there are no booster boxes of it so it's a little tougher oh we got charmander nice all right charmander baby we got the full evolution line of charizard too because i did pull this in uh charmillion in the other video like always where's blastoise of venusaur what's up with that i don't know all right, but yeah, we're definitely ditto. Okay, there's the energy hollow. We're definitely opening this up pretty early, which is pretty cool um, to be able to see. So hopefully you guys are enjoying seeing this early look at this set. It's a special set, like I mentioned before. 3.5 on Scarlet. We're already on the fourth, basically the fourth set here for Scarlet and Violet. Wow, already? Oh my God. <laughs> what? What? Wait, what is? Dude, is this card faded? Or am I losing my mind? Bro, this card is different. This card is different. How is that possible? This card has a different coloring to it. Uh, maybe they changed the printers or something, the ink or something during this production. But that's, I mean, it's from the same case of stuff. Like, it's in the same box. That is a completely different colored Charizard. Uh, that's, I mean, I noticed that right away. I'm like, what is happening? It almost looks faded um, compared to the one on the left. This is the one that I just pulled. That's the one on the left. And by the way, that's our seventh freaking Charizard. Did they mix up these cards like enough or is, are they all like kind of s stuck together or something? For some reason, like it doesn't make sense how I'm getting this many Charizard. Literally pulled seven Charizard so far. This is like actually unbelievable. Seven Charizard? Seven. That is the most pulled card today is Charizard. Like what? I'm actually kind of confused how this is even happening. Like what? Seven Charizard, right? I, I'm starting to lose count. That's insane. I don't know why. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's Psychic Hollow Energy. Come on, baby. Let's see what else we got here. Saying true, Scyther Charmeleon. All right. This is uh, this is kind of weird. You always notice weird things with every set that comes out. Oh my God! See, that's the same thing. This is, a, this is actually the third Alakazam floor that I pulled, two from today's video. It's almost like there's just similar pulls in the product. Like the... 
I don't, I don't know. It's weird. All right, let's keep going. <laughs> like I'm not pulling any of the other alt art, other full arts or special illustration arts. It's all just the Charizard stuff. I don't. I mean, you saw me open it, right? You saw me open it, right? What in the? Something. Something fishy's going on right now. Something weird's going on right now. Something real weird's going on right now. Ain't no way, bro. This is not real life right now. Oh my god. There's no way. There's. The, the, seriously, somebody tell help me figure out reality. One, two, three. Four of the EXs. One, two, three of the special illustrations and one four. There's something weird going on. There's something weird going on right now. What is this? I, I, I mean I thought that I thought these ETBs were insane, but they're they're like I'm confused! I don't know what's happening anymore. Oh my god, there we go, Blastoise, finally! Uh, yeah, it's about time, buddy. I don't know what else to say. I mean, you guys are watching this. That's just what I don't know. Just gonna keep going. Uh, the only thing I think of is there's some something where they like mix the cards up weird or didn't mix them up or they're all like like together somehow. That's what I was trying to say to make sense. But like they're in the same case, so maybe they're like, kind of like stuck together somehow. Like the odds of that have to be not real life, right? Like that doesn't make sense to me how that's even possible. Like you would think you would pull like a bunch of the other EXs. There's like literally 16 EXs in the set, I think. There's probably like 12 or more full arts. I don't even know exactly. Probably more than that. The, the special illustrations, there's probably at least like eight. But they're all just the Charizard. Okay. If only this was a battle against Veronica. Oh, I would, I would have won that unless she got all these ones, or I would have been destroyed. Oh, but I could have. I, I'd be like pulling. Oh my God, we would have been like eight Charizards in. All right. Well, this is gonna be the last booster pack of the video. I don't. Now I'm even more confused. Oh, I don't know anymore. I try to figure out things, and then it just doesn't make sense anymore. So. I'm just going to leave it at that. You guys tell me because I don't even know anymore. But this is our last booster pack. And remember, check back all week or I don't know if it's a like probably seven days straight of just uh, Pokemon 151. So make sure you come back tomorrow for some more really cool products that I'm excited to open up that I have not opened up yet. But I will with you guys here. Needle King to end it and Vaporeon. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to smash the like button on your way out. If you want more content, click on one of the two videos at the top there. Hit that subscribe button as well. And as always, I hope you have a great day and I will see you the next one.